Thai treasures. Gold ornaments in ancient civilizations, part two. Evidences of gold use in China have been found since 3,200 years ago, a large number from the Zhou Dynasty period, with gold designs decorated on the bronze works. It was also used to cover wood. In the Han Dynasty period, gold was commonly used as a medium of exchange in the trade of goods. In the Tang Dynasty's time, gold was mainly used in the making of Buddha images, Buddhist shrine offerings, and imperial utensils. This trend has been popularized to these days. In India, there have been records confirming the use of gold jewelry and gemstones over 3,500 years ago, from the descriptions of the ornaments of the gods. In the Rig Veda, an ancient Hindu sacred text, most of the gods were adorned with gold ornaments. It was the same in Persia, where there were numerous sites of gold deposits and fine gold jewelry crafted by highly gifted artisans in diverse forms, serving as prototypes for other cradles of civilization for a long time. India's oldest precious ornaments consisted of gold bead chains. Later, other precious items have been added, such as pearls. The best gold enameled ware of India were made by talented artisans in the states of Kashmir and Punjab, whose wondrous designs later spread to Delhi in central India and the state of Bengal. In western India, gold beads and colored glass beads were popularly strung together to make jewelry. In continental Europe, at Mycenae, in ancient Greece, dating back around 3,600 years, containers, ornaments, and masks made of gold have been found. Although Greece had only a few sites of gold deposit, ancient Greek documents referred to gold mines and mentioned that ancient Greeks were simply clad in lengths of woolen cloths which were wrapped and draped around their bodies. Short cloaks were worn over the top, so pins or brooches were needed to secure the cloths. Thus, ornaments in the forms of pins and brooches have been found in large numbers, along with the discovery of gold headdresses fashioned in the shapes of twigs or flowers. Armenia, another ancient kingdom, was famous for metal molding. It had a large source of gold reserve, the same as the ancient Bactria Kingdom in the present-day Afghanistan, where a large number of gold jewelry, such as brooches, were found, and goddess Aphrodite's bracelets serving as evidence of influences from Greece, India, and the Middle East.